Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to your daily dose of zombies news from the game and community here on COD Zombies HQ. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I've got a nice quick show for you guys today, so let's kick things right off with our first story. This one comes from a post made on the COD Zombies subreddit by a Reddit user named Billy Bucks Games entitled A Nice Little Easter Egg on Origins. He's specifically talking about Origins from Zombies Chronicles. I I'm sure some players have found this before. I've never seen any other Zombies YouTuber cover this nor have I ever heard of this before so I figure you guys might be interested but heading over near this muddy pathway over to Gen 2 if you look in one of the big puddles there's a few papers scattered on the ground upon closer inspection once you get close you realize those papers have names on them and once you read the names you can see that these are the names of the Treyarch developers that worked on Zombies Chronicles I'm zooming in on Jason Blundell here. I'll skip forward, you can see there's Kevin Sherwood. It is possible that this is the dev team that worked just on Origins, like the original version, and this is kind of like a homage to that team. Or it could just be the whole Zombies Chronicles team. I went ahead into Black Ops 2 and checked on the original Origins to see if this was there, and it wasn't. So this is a nice little Origins remastered Easter egg that is exclusive to the Zombies Chronicles version. It's a nice little nod to the developer and I definitely recommend you guys go check it out next time you're playing Origins in Zombies Chronicles. Now moving on to the second story of the day, Treyarch tweeted out congratulations to the Zombies Chronicles giveaway winner, Miss Lady Diamond. So unfortunately, if that's not you, you have not won the Zombies Chronicles giveaway that we talked about a few days ago where you can pin a few friends. So congratulations to you and your Zombies mates for winning the Zombies Chronicles prize pack. And moving on to the third story of the day, Reddit user Exotic Man Dancer posted this on the God Zombies subreddit entitled Dumb Nacht Easter Egg. And basically what he describes is a neat little Easter egg on Remastered Nacht that I didn't know was there. I'm sure you guys didn't know about this too. Sitting on the edge of the shelf in the help room, it's like right to the right after you enter the room for the first time from the ground floor. There's a German helmet sitting there and when you shoot it, this happens. Just take a listen. So they programmed it that every time you shoot this helmet, it makes the headshot sound effect, which in Zombies Chronicles sounds freaking awesome. And for our fourth story of the day, the Steam Summer Sale is on for all you PC players. Bvat over on Reddit posted a nice breakdown of the games that are on sale as well as their prices in US dollars. If you haven't bought Black Ops 3 or the Seasons Pass, they're all on sale. My personal recommendation is if you haven't bought Call of Duty World at War, that's COD 5 yet, it's $9.99 US on the Steam sale right now. It can run on most old machines for you people that don't have gaming PCs. It is bar none the best Call of Duty that there is in my own personal opinion. Zombies is fantastic. Custom Zombies in that game is even better. The multiplayer is still going on strong and is a whole lot of fun. And it's got one of the most exciting campaigns in a Call of Duty that you can also play co-op with your friends. Anyways guys, that wraps up today's show. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to smash that thumbs up button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. I do want to give a big shout out to everybody that's part of the notification squad. If you guys aren't aware, clicking on that bell button beside the subscribe and turning on notifications means you're part of the notification squad. You'll get notified of the latest videos as they're uploaded first. And I always love responding to you guys in the comments that are all notification squad hype. Anyways, guys, I want to thank you again for watching and I'll see you with another Zombies news update tomorrow. Okay.